focus sports so today august 23rd is kobe bryant would have been 45 years old and kobe bryant played for the lakers for 20 seasons I think that the world is still somewhat in shock of what happened. I remember, I remember being at home and somebody, a couple of people text me and I was like, Kobe, huh? And I was like, well, maybe it ain't Kobe Bryant. I get online and it just seems like whatever news station and I was slipping through the cable, my cable too at the time. And everybody was just talking about Kobe. And people who didn't even watch basketball was texting me about Kobe Bryant. And I just remember feeling sad. And when I found out that his daughter had passed away, it, it, that really hurt too because I was rooting for Gigi. I honestly think that she was going to change women's basketball. They were going to make her the face of women's basketball. And Kobe and Kobe was going to be kind of like how Venus and Serena Williams' dad was. I remember him training her, and he was like, oh, we, we practice every day. And it's just, it's unfortunate what happened that day. One thing that I did learn about Kobe I watched him play pretty much all 20 seasons was his worth ethic he was very different than as a traditional athlete growing up over overseas in Italy and not necessarily being from a inner city And like I said, some people say he spoke very articulate and said learned new multiple languages. I believe he had a really high GPA score. He was supposed to go to Duke. That was the thing he talked about going to Duke. But for him just to... I don't know. I, I feel like people... They hated him, but towards the end of his career, they saw the greatness in him. And I remember when he, when they won that first title in 2000, Kobe was, what, 21? And I remember trying to be like Kobe, and he's one of the reasons I realized that the basketball isn't for me. And I'm also not 6'6", like how he is. But he was just, he was a workaholic. Y'all remember he even had his own game too back in the day. Um, NBA courtside. I actually had, I believe, two of them. And he well, he had only been what this might I think this might have been before he won the title. He was what, 19, 18, 19? Had his own video game. This back in the day you actually had it was actually multiple games. It wasn't just 2K or Madden. Almost every player had their own NBA game or NFL game. But he's just, he's somebody that you can model after. He never, he never, um, like he never really took plays off. Now, he, well, he did have that one series where people, it just looked like he just said, forget it. But most of the time, he, he was always a person to show up late. I mean, show up early, leave late. He would outwork all his competition. Like I said, he was a loner. And, you know, people used to be like, oh, man, he won't go to the... I remember him talking about how Magic was like, you should... Why don't you go to the club with the guys? He's like, I'm here to play basketball. Kobe was the... Just like Mike, he was somebody that was obsessed with his craft. Even through his... The thing that happened in uh, was it 2003? He, Carmelo talked about it. How he, they didn't know if he was gonna play in the game. And he came after that court date and and still played and, and hit a important shot on the Nuggets. So Kobe was uh, 
one heck of a guy, man. He's definitely missed when he passed away. Every city honored him, uh, the ones that could. He went on that farewell tour. I don't remember. I mean, well, I seen Mike retire, but it just, I guess I'm a little older now. It's just like, wow, every city, people hated Kobe, but everybody was like, wow, Kobe is, you saw his greatness at the end. And then the man invested in, what's that water company? Not vitamin water. What's the name of that water company, y'all? I mean, the, uh, I'm afraid, I, they can't think of it right now, but he invested in that. And that blew up. Now, where several his investments were $700 million. He won an Oscar. Like, Kobe was on his way to the next. Like to his next hobbies. I remember he talked about he don't even miss playing basketball no more. Hold on, y'all. Let me look up that water that before I end this. What's the name of that? Body armor, y'all. My bad. He invested in body, body armor. So, like, he was... Him and Alex Rodriguez did an interview. Oh, I can't remember who was with, but they both talked about, like, how they they did, they was on to the next thing. And Kobe always said, like, when he left the game, he had no regrets. He didn't want no regrets. So, that's why he didn't vacation with people. None of that. And it's just sad to see that he was only retired for, what, four years You know, before his life ended, tragically, him and the other victims that was on a um, helicopter. But, man, it's just, it, we just, Kobe was just invincible to everybody. And he's definitely the number, the second greatest shooting guard of all time. Top 10, he's in some people's top five, even top three, and I really can't argue that. But what's y'all think? What's y'all memories of Kobe? Happy birthday, Mamba.